Yo, what's up, world? It's your man, Slim Jim Longfoot, a.k.a. the GOAT, King of America. Welcome to day 1161 of Diabetes and I, the daily vlog series that I do to show you how I combat this type 2 diabetes with the 1 2, you feel me? Yo, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe down below. Hit that notification bell so you can keep up on all things Slim Jim Longfoot, such as my product reviews, my how to videos for YouTubers, my TV and movie reviews, my reactions, my uh, video clips, my live streams, my daily vlogs that you're watching right now, and last but not least, my art video series, GOAT 1408 TV. Shout outs to the members of the live chat crew. Most notable members include um, Sexy Trees 1408, Queen Candace, Michael Marshall, Life's Magical Journey, Wellness with Frugal Mama, and last but not least, my sis, the big sis of YouTube, Latanya Porter. Special consideration to my bro, Johnny Quest Gaming, who co hosts the Nerd Strip Club with me. You ain't checked that guy's channel yet. What you waiting on? What you waiting on? What you waiting on? Go do that there. Go do that there. Go do that there. Big. Also, shout outs to the members of the 14 Light, which includes Kill Wonders Life of Wonder, Gaming Mode, Advice with Mel, Elevate with Vern, Blackjack 939, Pro Loner, and and that last but not least, eat to live strong. If you yourself would like to be a member of the 14 way, all you gotta do is wait for a little minute until we get back monetized on the channel. So until then, if you truly want to support Slim Jim Long for and all the endeavors, check out the links in the description below. The links in the description below includes the books I've written, the books I've drawn, the merchandise that I have, and last but not least, uh, my sister's cash app is down below on behalf of my niece Paris who was shot um, 460 days ago today, 460 days ago today on the 2nd of February 2022. Um, she is um, in such great um, spirits, man, and she is surviving and thriving. You know what I'm saying? Hashtag Paris Strong, hashtag prayers for Paris, whether that's F-O-R or the number four. Continue to, you know, manifest you know what I'm saying, the healing onto my niece. I appreciate that so, so, so much from y'all. That is appreciated more than you can ever imagine, you feel me? So, with that being said, let's continue to, you know what I'm saying, manifest um, those prayers and those blessings of healing into play. Today is Monday. It is May the 8th, 2023. It is right now currently 12 14 uh, p.m. Um, so I'm getting to y'all kind of late. I'm about to eat my first meal of the day, which is some old school oatmeal. Um, so that is what the move is today. As always, you know what I'm saying? We strive to recognize the greatness within ourselves, you know what I'm saying, and manifest greatness as well on all levels from that physical level to that mental level to that spiritual level to that emotional level to that financial level those are the levels of greatness that we want to manifest and recognize you feel me because at the end of the day you know what else is it that you truly need to recognize you know what i'm saying you know recognize that you are loved each and every day by the most high by god and love yourself you know what I'm saying? once you love yourself anything is possible because you're going to make it make your life better for yourself because you love yourself right that part mm. so that's why i will continue to say and preach that love is the greatest motivator of anything because when you love yourself you want to do your best for yourself because um, guess what I'm quite sure everybody has had a moment in their life where they didn't love themselves right and you didn't love yourself things wasn't popping right because you wasn't putting any energy into 
yourself as far as your own well-being. You know, when you don't love yourself, you know, everything is not going to fall into place. Even if you got people in your life who love you. If you don't love yourself, it ain't gonna matter. I'm quite sure a lot of y'all have most likely been in a relationship with somebody like that. And those are definitely the wrong people to be in a relationship with. People who don't love themselves because if they don't love themselves, they're definitely not gonna give you the type of love you deserve. And at the end of the day, anybody's love is just extra because when you love you that's all anybody else's love is is extra yes it's wanted yes it could possibly be even needed but when you already love you you good So, that's why I want everybody who is watching this to strive for that energy. If you have the capacity to love, first and foremost, you got to love yourself. You know, if you can love, you can love everybody. But first, first, first person you gotta love is yourself. You know what I'm saying? If you don't love yourself, then that's where you need to reconfigurate your love wheel and get it back on track. Love God. Love yourself. place you know what I'm saying because there was a there there's a point where you know people try to or systems or society try to make you feel like loving yourself ain't right loving yourself is selfish or whatever but remember you are the center of your whole life your life doesn't evolve or revolve around somebody else you are the center of your life. Now, I know, you know, people say, but I got kids, so you know my life revolves around them, blah, blah, blah. You know, but that's just part of it. You know, think of yourself like um, the sun. You know, all the planets revolve around you. And you, in turn, give them heat. You give heat out to all of those planets. Now, your kids, obviously, will be like the Earth because the Earth is the one planet that we at least know of in this system that sustains life, that is growing that is nurtured yeah and we got some crazy stuff going on here on earth but at the same time you know your heat your light is providing you know what I'm saying that warmth and that substance and everything like that and so the earth continues to revolve and do its thing I don't know I'm just going with different little analogies metaphors whatever whatever but back to the point you gotta love yourself first before you can give that love out to anybody else you know what I'm saying it's like how can you help somebody else when you down true you know helping somebody when you down could bring you up as well but at the same time, you still got to be up too. You know, 
old saying goes, who helps the helper? Who saves the hero? Who makes the clown laugh or the comedian laugh? So those are the things that you want to strive for in this life. Which is why all of a sudden over the past years or decades, you know, people have been implementing implementing and speaking more about self love. Because, you know, for so long people will demonize loving yourself in certain forms of now there are some people who are just overboard with uh, with anything you can go overboard and be addictive you know becoming narcissist narcissist and vain and just too absorbed into yourself you know once again it's this thing called balance so you gotta balance your scales just got to gotta have life balance in your life that's what I'm gonna call that's what I'm pulling the title of this one balance your life So, with that being said, do that. Because all you got is today. Whether you watching this on May the 8th, May the 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, June, July, August, September, 2024, 20, 2025, 2026, 2100, whenever you're watching this balance your life these are keys for all time especially as the world continues to change society begins to become more automated and the human element is becoming extinct that's why At the end of the day, you got to do what's best for you and what's best for you. Get the ones you love and watch that spread because love is the key, man. Love is the key. Simple as that. Now, I appreciate y'all coming for my. TED talk. Anywho, hold me off the chain. With that being said, I appreciate y'all once again for watching. And now, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It is time for the shout, 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 hey, 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 shout, 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 hey, hey, hey. It's time for the shout outs, baby. It's time for the shout outs, baby. Well, I said balance your life. Yeah. Balance your life, baby. And uh, yesterday we dropped day 1160. 
the regular comment section. Oh, nobody was in the regular comment section. Um, in the live chat, we got the life of Sweet Angel Christine. I was in the building. Life's magical journey was in the house. Hey, and that part, that was it. I appreciate y'all most awesome ladies for coming through, showing up and showing out. I appreciate you who watching this right now. Whether you watching this in the premiere of this daily vlog or you watching in the playback, in the replay, laid back, way back in the playback, made back. So with that being said, I'm gone, y'all. Stay blessed up. I will see y'all on the next go around. Um, peace. Video. Playlist. Watch them all, all right? One love.